I love curry. Now, there's so many different curries. There's so many methods to make curry. And today we are making a Caribbean curry. I have chicken thighs. I put them all in a bag and I squeezed two limes and added the curry into this. So this chicken is flavored with curry powder and lime juice. And we're gonna saute that together so that the curry infuses into our vegetables. So let's go ahead and get started. Uh, I have a little bit of butter. Usually in Jamaica, you would only find olive oil, so I decided to add a little bit of both. These are all of the things that are gonna give us flavor. I have a tiny little mince of shallot, same thing of garlic, a very fine julienne of fresh ginger. So this is a mince of a couple of chilies, so I'm gonna add that now. All right, start mixing that about. Once everything starts to soften a little bit, I'm gonna add some small dice of chayote. And then also I've got some potatoes because in most curry you'd find some potatoes. So these are peeled Yukon gold. Now I'm gonna add the chicken. These are diced chicken thighs. We bought boneless, skinless chicken thighs for this. And you wanna make sure that everything gets a nice sear. So once everything has seared, the liquids that, that we're gonna cook this in, and this is what really makes it Jamaican, is mainly coconut milk. And a little bit of chicken stock just to cover. And this is gonna take at least half an hour to 40 minutes to stew. So let me show you what it looks like when it's done. So we have a little bit of just steamed white rice and a little spoonful of this gorgeous yellow chicken curry in coconut. I can really smell the ginger and the curry and the coconut is just lovely. What a gorgeous bowl of comfort food. Come and get it. In need of delicious Jamaican curry chicken? Go to checkpleasefl.com for my recipe.